Here's an overview of accepting card present transactions in your virtual terminal. So the first step you want to take is to simply connect a Pennyware card reader to your computer with Bluetooth or a USB. In order to complete this process, you'll need three things. One, a Mac or Windows computer. Then two, a two-in-one or three-in-one Bluetooth reader and then a USB cord. And three, to download the Pennyware app driver to your computer. The link is provided in your virtual terminal. Once you have everything you need, the first step is to install the Pennyware app driver to your computer. You find the login and navigate to the virtual terminal. Select Use a Card Reader. Then select Download Driver. Now, the next steps vary depending on if you're on a Mac or a PC, so we'll go over both. On a Mac, first you want to open the download file. Then drag the Pannyware app driver icon into your applications folder. And then three, open the Pannyware app driver. On a Windows computer, click the download file and install the app. Then proceed through the setup wizard, allowing the app access to your computer to finish the installation process. If you haven't already done so, connect your reader via a USB or Bluetooth. Then navigate back to your virtual terminal and select Use a Card Reader once more. You might have to refresh the page for this to update. Then click Open Pay Anywhere when the pop-up appears. And check Always Open These Types of Links in order to skip this step in the future. Now you're ready to accept payments. Accepting a card present virtual terminal transaction. First, enter the payment amount, transaction details, and customer information. Then click Start Reader and wait for the reader to initiate. Third, insert or swipe the card. Then, remove the card when prompted, and you'll see an approved status when the transaction has been processed. You can then print the receipt if you need to capture a signature, or send your customer an email or text receipt. Card present transactions in your payments hub. It's here through the virtual terminal. As always, if you have questions, reach out to our customer support and we're always glad to help.